uh, it's been quite important because of uh, caring for my mother and father and because there's um, so much information out there when you start looking um, you need to try to sort of pinpoint certain areas so it becomes a sort of a, a huge mist a fog you know and um, health information once you do find the right stuff can really save time energy um, sort of support and the care that you give to somebody and the care and the support that you can get in so when I started caring it took me up to three to four years before I actually managed to put in got the right information that I needed and put it in the right spot. It took a long time. Well, the kind of information I'm accessing is mental health based information as well as uh, social care support information. Um, specifically, the mental health information makes it good because uh, I might not know about a certain condition that my father has and I don't understand it and then how to look after somebody with that kind of a condition that information can sort of give me, can signpost me, it can give me access to information on the internet or where, where to go on the internet and also it can give me information which is relevant to specific conditions and behaviours and actions and, and what, what it means and, and obviously how to then tackle it. Well what tends to work for me is especially when there's links and you're signposted that's really important and being able to know exactly where to look and what to look for that's important because once it becomes web based then you know this whole world opens up and if I was looking at something without first looking at let's say some literature maybe or seeing a poster in a GP surgery or even going along to uh, let's say a forum or a coffee morning and it's very specific stuff and because then I can go onto the web and I can look at something that's specific, so for example Alzheimer's and there's so much thing, stuff out there about Alzheimer's but I can go to the Alzheimer's Society website and I found that link through some literature. Well there's, there's a lack of um, information for people who are either specifically in service users or carers who are in, who are in roles for uh, an extended period. It's very good for somebody who's in the beginning but it's very bad for somebody who's been in a role for an extended period. You that's when you tend to be you know, a little bit more lost and you need a little bit more support. And I think it would be good to have sort of stuff that's a little bit more advanced. And also content. I'd like more content sometimes. You know, where can I find more content rather than just like a, uh, like a strap line or just a, a paragraph. Sometimes I want to go into depth on something and that's hard to find.